Ferret goes with his wife to a cave to eat. The doctor informs the family that Halas Ega's condition is good and they can all safely go home. That's what everyone does. Journalists are waiting for them all before leaving the hospital. They are asking about Kalis Ega's condition. Pillow watches all this and sees Ferret and Stran approach the car together holding hands. In anger, she tells her cousin, who happens to be next to her at that moment, to arrange a meeting with the guy he recently introduced her to. Siran and Ferret are returning home. They talk for a long time and even manage to quarrel because Yusuf took Siran to the airport. A new day is coming. By breakfast, Kalis Asu is discharged and he arrives home. Everyone greets him. Siran is happy that everything has started to get better. Immediately after arrival, Kalis Ege invites Siran to his place and tells her to go somewhere and take a walk, buy something for herself. That's what they do they go to the Paziria. But Ferret, having found out what was singing, is having fun somewhere and goes to her, which offends Siran very much. Siran returns to the mansion without Ferret. Gulgin notices this and starts questioning her. Ferret also arrives here. Siren tells Gulgan the truth, that he left her alone in a cave and went to Pillow. Then the quarrel continues in the room and Ferret offends Siren very much. As a result, Siren decides to return to his father's house. After Siren leaves, Ferret goes crazy. When he comes to himself, he calls his brother, who is driving with his father to Kazim's house at that time and tells them not to come to them without him. They obey. Meanwhile, Kazim blames Siran herself for everything that happened. Firit arrives and without talking to either his father or his brother goes into Kazim's apartment. Despite Kazim's ban, he pushes him away and goes to look for his wife Nadia kidnaps her. Siren screams and kicks, but it's pointless. No one stops Ferret, not even that Abidin. Ferret informs Siren that they will be out of town for a few days and need to buy groceries for this. Siren resists at first, but then agrees. They go to the store and buy groceries. Next, Ferret takes Siren to their country house. Siren notices that it is very cold at home and Ferret goes to chop wood. Siren looks at the process of Ferret chopping firewood and realizes that he does not know how to do anything. 